We have some breaking news to talk about today because we finally got a release date for Black Widow. It is going to be coming to theaters and on Disney Plus on July 9th. Of course, with Disney Plus, you're going to need Premiere Access, which basically means that you're going to have to pay an extra 30 bucks in order to watch the movie on the platform that you are already giving money to. Uh, so they they did this with Milan last year and everything else. And I, I when I had Disney Plus, I was like, you know what? I'm not going to pay extra money in order to watch your stupid movie on your site so i didn't give them the extra money to watch milan and uh, i mean i don't even have disney plus anymore so i'm not going to be watching black widow at all as you can see here this is my disney plus account it says welcome back seems like you're not subscribed did you cancel or let your subscription end and then down here says restart subscription but i'm not going to be doing that because i'm not going to be giving disney any more of my money after the insane nonsense that, that they pulled with the whole gina carano situation they fired gina carano for a, a tweet, a, a, a post that she made on social media, uh, an opinion that she had. They fired her for that. And since then, they have also cut out her episode uh, on the Barrack Grills show and everything else. Like, this is insane. And I'm not going to give money to a company that is going to fire people for conservative opinions that they don't like or just opinions in general that they don't like. That is insane to me. And I'm not going to support a company that is going to be dealing in such a neo-Marxist fascist way. I'm not going to give them money. I I, I gave D Disney some of my money with Disney Plus for a while and stuff. I was like, you know what? There's some there's some good things on here that, that my daughter can watch, like some of the older Pixar movies, some of the older Disney movies. I was like, you know what? Maybe this will be a nice thing for her to have. But after the whole Gina Carano thing, I was like, you know what? I'm not going to give Disney another dollar again. So... I probably will not be watching Black Widow at all unless I watch it on someone else's Disney Plus account, maybe at a friend's house or something like that. But I, I either otherwise, I'm not going to be going to watch it in theaters. I'm not going to be watching it on Disney Plus. I'm not going to be giving Disney any money for this movie. And, uh, you know, that's that's obviously my my opinion on it. If you guys are still obviously subscribed to Disney Plus or whatever else, that is that's up to you. That is your money. You should be the ones to decide what you do or do not do with your money. I'm not going to tell you what you should or shouldn't do with your money. But for me personally, I'm not going to be giving Disney any more of my money. I am done with them. I have cut them out of my life completely. And Disney is dead as far as I'm concerned. Which is a shame because if you know anything about the history of Walt Disney and what he stood for and the fact that he actually... He... he couldn't even stand communism at all he hated communism he he couldn't stand communists and he actually took a very strong stance against that and uh, that's just one of the, the great things that walt disney stood for to see where they're at right now as a company disney just how corrupt they are as a company it is a real real shame so uh you know i guess uh, we'll have to wait and see but for those who are excited about this movie you guys are going to be able to watch it on July 9th. Uh, of course, I, there's no way that I would ever, even if I had Disney Plus still, I wouldn't be paying for the premiere access at all. Because it's like 30 bucks extra for a subscription that you're already paying for, which is insane. And people aren't happy about that in the comments. BS, why am I paying extra for a single film on a streaming service that I already pay for? Premiere Access, are you effing kidding me? I pay this every month and you make me pay extra to watch a movie I've been waiting for for years. So people aren't very happy about it in the comments either. But let me know what you think about this in the comments below. What do you think about the trajectory of Disney that they are continuing to censor and fire people who have opinions that they don't like on in their company i think that is a really dangerous move that they're that they're playing a dangerous game that they're playing and i hope i sincerely hope that more americans will wake up to realize this dangerous game this dangerous precedent that disney is setting forth for the future and i hope they will continue to think about maybe not giving disney any more financial support but like i said at the end of the day that is up to you hope you guys enjoyed this video subscribe for new and i will talk to you all very soon in another video Talk to you later. Bye.